hello, welcome or welcome back. It is Wednesday, my dudes, and it is time for a halo eye. I've said this at the beginning of the other two looks, but I'm going to be using this palette here. This is a BYOP build your own palette that I did this previous Friday. If you would like to check it out, the video is up on my channel or up in the cards. Without further ado, let's get into this halo eye. I'm going to start with the shade Memory. This is from the Tati uh, Textured Neutrals palette, just a matte black. And I'm going to pop this um, in my inner and outer corner. And I'm not quite taking this into my crease, I'm taking it just below my crease. Also putting just a tiny, tiny bit under my eye. And our corner's always fun, because I don't have much space. And then, we'll see how this goes. I want to try blending this with Shake It Up from the ColourPop Strawberry Shake palette. Like I said, we'll see how this goes. I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. We're going to try it, though. There's no harm in trying, right? Right. Oh, because these are so different, this might take a little while, but I think it might be worth it. Black to pink is not a five minute blend, unfortunately. Looking a little rough. Just bear with me. Um, I'm going to now take the shade Poodle and I'm going to use that as my next blending shade. So this is a nice bright pink. So I think this will help kind of tie things together a little bit more. I hope. We'll see. I'm going to connect my crease with whatever's left on my brush. Same down here. Okay, kind of messy, kind of grungy, but I'm digging it. I'm digging it. All right, now going into the center, I'm gonna take the shade Smokin' from the um, ColourPop Smoke Show palette. And I'm just going to pop this on either side of the center of my eye. Be kind of a transition into the very center shade. And then I'm going to take Shell Shock. This is from Urban Decay. It was a single. I don't know if they still sell it as a single. Um, they revamped their single eyeshadows, and now I couldn't tell you if this is still available. But it is gorgeous. This is such a pretty silver. It's just incredible. It goes on forever. I'm just taking a little bit more of Smokin' um, to help blend the two together. Make it look nice and blended. Now... I'm going to take this color right here. This is a Franken Shadow. Um, it is Wink Wink and Kitten Parade from Sugar Pill mixed together. And I'm just going to highlight my inner corner with this. All right. 
eyes are done. Now we're moving on to the face. Oh, um, but my eyeliners are uh, the KVD Cake Pencil in Trooper Black. I tight lined and put this on the inner and outer corners of my eyes. And then I used the LA Girl Pastel Dream Liner in Marshmallow on the center of my waterline. And now it's time for some blush. This is the e.l.f. That was loud. This is the e.l.f. Primer Infused Shimmer Blush in Always Silly. And for my highlighter, I'm using the Amuse Cosmetics Illuminate Pro in Iconic. It's just a nice highlighter. It's very affordable. It's like a dollar. Um, if you go to shop miss a dot shop miss a shop miss a whichever one it is. They got a bunch of makeup for a dollar on there. Some of it's really good. Some of it's not. But I would definitely recommend this highlighter. For my lips today, keeping it real simple and pretty natural, I am going for the ColourPop Ultra Blotted Lip in Doozy. I want gloss. Hold on. I want a gloss. I'm gonna use my e.l.f. Cosmetics Lip Lacquer in Mauve Glitz on top. All right, there we go. Finished look. Kind of, like I said, kind of grungy, kind of messy, but I'm digging it. Um, it's the vibe today. I don't know. I've got silver all over my shirt. Okay, well that is it for me. Um, thanks for hanging out with me and I hope you have a great Wednesday and I'll be back tomorrow with another video. So I hope I see you then. Bye!